Today I thought of sharing hot cross buns with chocolate chip recipe. For that I'm using 200 grams of bread flour with 50 grams of plain flour, 6 grams yeast, 1 egg and 35 grams butter, 100 grams chocolate chips, 50 grams caster sugar, 80 to 100 milliliters of milk that will vary the size of depends on the size of the egg and quarter teaspoon of salt with one teaspoon of cinnamon or mixed spice and I have the soft sponge dough which I made several hours before this is with 50 grams of bread flour and 70 grams boiling water so always put the flour on the scale and onto that weigh the hot water 70 grams and mix it well and leave it aside so to start this add the bread flour and the plain flour into the mixing bowl and into that yeast sugar the egg and the prepared sponge dough and start mixing it and add the salt into that now so into the flour mix add a teaspoon of cinnamon and start adding milk little by little until it becomes a soft dough but make sure you add the milk little by little after adding the milk keep on kneading 5 minutes after kneading 5 minutes add the butter and keep on kneading another 10 minutes when the dough is ready take it out and leave it in a warm place until it double in size when the hot cross buns dough is ready put some flour onto the bench top and put the dough onto the bench add more flour onto the top and next add the chocolate chips the reason why I didn't add the chocolate chips when I was kneading so it will melt when you uh, leave it to proof but when you add the chocolate chips after it stays on like that so keep on kneading adding the chocolate chips about two to three minutes so after kneading add some more flour and divide the dough into equal size portions um, the size of the bun that you like to have so I have eight equal size portions so I'm going to leave aside and take one put more flour onto the bench and press it down and roll it like this and then take both ends together down and use your palm if you like you can have individual buns but I like to put it in a uh, tray and make it like the ones that you find in cafes or even in supermarkets so I'm going to put that on a tray so after I'm going to leave this again in a warm place until it double in size the buns are ready so I'm going to put the cross on the top so for that I'm using two tablespoons of plain flour and enough water to mix and mix it well and make a smooth paste it has to be a bit runny so I put that into a snap lock bag or a sandwich bag so close it if you don't have a piping bag don't worry so cut the the tip with a scissor just a tiny one and after pipe across on the bun like this so bake this on 180 about 10 to 15 minutes and sorry you need to egg wash the buns before you pipe the cross on the top too 
I finished baking the hot cross buns and as you can see it's just like from the supermarket or even uh, from your cafe and if I take one and open one to show you how it's how soft it is it's really soft and moist and with full of chocolate if you are not a chocolate lover you can use sultanas instead so hope you will enjoy this thank you for watching